What's up, everybody? We are back again with another episode of Face of the Franchise. Josh Matthews, QB of the Houston Texans. Let's see how we do this week. Maybe we're better, maybe we're worse. We're playing the Chargers, which is a hard team, but we'll see how it goes. Let's start with our week. Should we do a call out? We're doing a call out today. Yeah. I'm feel, feeling dangerous, man. Big Brother Community Outreach. Let's do Community Outreach. This is private practice. Space. All good. And then, boom. Let's get our work in. Sim through practice. We're 2 and 1. Hey Josh, any chance you can stop by tomorrow when you get to the facility? I've got a great community outreach opportunity for you at the end of the week. I'm ready. For sure, Andy. I'm ready for whatever you wanted to throw at me. That's the spirit. Mindset off the field is the same as on the field. I see. Great. I see. Great. I'll see you when you get in there. Cool. Appreciate you looking out for these opportunities. You should let us see them. But it's EA. <laughs> they won't do that cutscene. Can I do this? Yeah. That's interesting. V team set goal weekly goals this week. Are you ready? Oh, look at this. It's week four of the National Football League. This one features Kareem Hunt, coming off an incredible effort over 200 yards rushing. It's the Texans and the Chargers. All okay. that and more coming up next. Gunner versus Gunner. Who has the best wide receivers? Um, complete 50% of your passes. Come in. We're going to get a timeout here by the offense. They'll have two remaining as we step aside here in this first quarter. Nice oh. on. Error, error, error. A first carry now for Kareem Hunt. And he's brought down, getting this one up to about the 35. Right away, they rack up 10 yards on their first play from scrimmage. Last week, of course, the great performance, over 200 yards. He still wants to be fed. And they should. That's exactly what you should do. I have not yet met a running back that's run for over 200 yards. Go, 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 go. This is the very next week. Hey, let's back things up. Yeah, I don't need it as much. No, they want it more and more. They're going to be ready to go. First they down. Think that's going to happen naturally. That's good for 21 yards and a first down. Yeah. Jet sweep, baby. Jet sweep. Calling him. On the jet sweep, there goes Collins. And he's going to fight his way forward here for a modest game. Tackle made by the safety, Derwin James. The Texans had two and one now to start the campaign. And they come in feeling pretty good after back-to-back -back victories, CD. And I thought that they played pretty well last week. Their execution, their discipline, their resilience. All display in that victory. And he's brought to the ground with another first down at the Chargers 27-yard line. They pick up 12 on the play there, and they move the chains. Stick. Oh, there's this is not a good play, bro. On first and ten, Matthews. Oh, this one incomplete. The pressure got to him as he released it. And it's second down. Second and ten now oh, for the play. 27. He's back on. Hunt will try going up the middle. And down inside the 15, shy of the 10. 
46 yards rushing for him already. A terrific <laughs> opening drive on the ground. And it's a first down. The eight door set should be open. Or cooks. Looking to throw. Matthews. That is caught at the seven yard line. And they get him down after a pickup of eight. Second and two. Never make the mistake that the slot receivers, especially the little guys that we're watching here, are just quicker than fast. A lot of them combine okay, quickness we're, and we're speed. Go, we're and we're they catch a lot of footballs, as we just saw there. A minimal gain there on the eighth play of the drive. Not much on that run, Charles. No, that's exactly the way to execute a run blitz there. They guessed correctly that they would move the ball on the ground, honed in Eat on him. it, and stopped Eat them. Him. Mucked that A score! He's in for the score! Touchdown! That rookie was unstoppable. Kareem Hunt with his sixth rushing touchdown of the year. And the Texans get the upper hand as they're on the board first here this afternoon. Do they have, oh, they have two safeties. They play two safeties. It's so annoying. Fudge. On first down, Matthews. And the throw left sideline here is caught, but they're ruling incomplete. Couldn't keep his feet in. Second down. Following the incomplete pass, here they go again. Second and 10 for the 25. Here's a toss right side for Oh Hunt. my God, he knocked the crap nice out of Nice little him. juke. Flashes another juke. And he'll be out of bounds right at the 40. 15 yards, the Texans pick up the first down. We use the word relentless a lot with guys who are aggressive on the field. In this case, it really fits, doesn't it? How about his ability to break tackles and his feet never stop moving? Throwing on first down. Matthews to the sideline, and that is a heck of oh, a catch well, Matt, as he was able to get both feet in. A timeout here for... And now hold everything here as the challenge... Did you catch it? Did you catch it? Did you catch it? What is that ankle? Did he keep those feet in bounds? That's the question they've got to decide. And I, I got to say, watching it in real time, it was awfully close. Yeah, it certainly looked like a heck of a catch because he Don't didn't appear to bobble it, which could complicate things. We'll bobble. But even with the Breath benefit of replay, that's pretty tight. Here's the, uh, here's the call. After review of the play, ruling on the field. So the challenge there does not go their way. Yeah. This will indeed remain a completed pass. That's only challenging now. That's cool. On first down, they'll run with Hunt. And this time they were ready for him as they'll stop him right at the line of scrimmage. Joey Bosa so strong, able to find his way in there to make the play. Looking to throw on second down. Matthews. He's got it at the 15. That is my touchdown! That is how you do it! Do not let Cooks open! Touchdown Cooks number eight on the air! And the Texans have taken the lead! Well, that's a heck of a response to regain the lead after we had seen the touchdown. Yeah, nobody cares. We're still ahead. Let's fake it, guys. They'll start with Hunt on the ground. Oh, he knocked it. And he'll take this ahead for about four. Second down coming up. Well, on every play call, you realize it's not going to go for a touchdown. So a lot of your calls are setting things up for maybe oh later in the game. Trying to establish the inside run. Run with toughness now. Hopefully get to the perimeter later. And let's face it, you could do worse than a four-yard. And that's caught inside the five. <laughs> And the Texans are able to stay quickly to add on to their lead. Let's go! Boy, Charles, this offense is just so explosive. They lead the league in scoring. And another example of just how good they are right there on that play. Yeah, we often overstate about how explosive teams are, but this team is truly a threat to score on every snap. Let's 
To begin the drive, here's a handoff to Hunt. Oh, he's got some oh, look at that. room. And he's taken down, but yeah. able to slip across the 35. 84 yards rushing for him as he has been tough to stop here this first half. And we've hit the two-minute mark in this first half of action. Come all the way up at the 38 now after a good start to the drive. Safeties. So I think A is going to be open here. I have two safeties. Back to throw. Matthews. There goes a deep ball. End zone. And it's knocked away and incomplete. Yeah. I like the fact that he took the shot deep downfield. Even if you don't get the oh, catch, for me. maybe you get a defensive maybe penalty and pick up the yardage that way. If I can't, I get to the And second and ten, he'll look to throw again. Got an open man, the tight end, Jarwin. And he's got room. Yes, he's he is out of bounds inside the 35. Okay. And it appears we have a charger shaken up on that last play. The medical staff is going to come out here and take a look, and we will take a short break. From the 34 now, here's first and 10. Looking to throw. Matthews. That's complete. It's Collins. And he gets this one inside the 15, just a yard or two shy of the 10. That's back-to-back -back plays of over 20 yards. So many times in my career, coaches are one thing. As long as we're there at the catch and we get guys on the ground, we can live with that. But if you're going to give up 10, 12, oh. 15 yards after the catch, then your defense is going to be out of the Now a throw to the end zone, a first down, but it winds up incomplete. They'll run with Hunt on second down. And strong running there as he's inside the 10 and down to the 8 yard line. That's rude. Four yards the gain, and it'll bring up a third down. They are in need of six yards here if they hope to move the chains. And a dangerous throw there as that's down and incomplete. What an excellent defensive stand there in the red zone. Nice tight coverage. Okay. Certainly... Good job, defense. Did we score? The devil happened. How did we not kick a field goal? They'll begin the drive upon. That was slick, He's bro. He's tackled a yard short of the marker. Good gain of nine on first down. And there was one of the downsides of blitzing during a rundown because sometimes you get out of your gaps. You don't fit the run quite as well because you're headed towards the ball carrier with abandon. On right, second down, right back to Hunt. That one, a first down pickup of eight. Well, you still have to give a little credit here because they are playing this game now at their Let's pace. Go, this is ball Let's control go. football, sustained runs, taking their time, and making it work. Let's and he's going to ball his way forward to the 48. It's a six-yard gain on the ground, and that'll make it second and four. Well, I think after that run, the defense get back in the huddle and looking at each other and maybe starting to so question their confidence a bit. They gave up a significant run, six There's yards, should be, oh, uh, and now you're saying to yourself, how do we now. stop them, and do I have enough confidence to make a play? Now here's a throw, it's complete. Ooh, He's got room at the 30, and they'll wind up getting this one all the way down inside the 20. It's a gain of 35. We know play calls can be very creative in this game today, but sometimes when they get receivers with speed like this, they don't need to design incredibly complex calls. Sometimes it's just get the ball in his hands and let him do his thing. In a sense, less can become more. And oh, she's right there. Over here. And the Texans let him go. First and goal is he'll be taken down at the seven-yard line. Show the way they're moving the ball down the field. They had a big play a moment ago. Followed up with another nice one here. And before you know it, they're already looking at first and goal. They'll give to Hunt here on the action. He not 117 the yards for him on the ground now as he has been terrific here this afternoon. Two of their three red zone trips so far they've come up empty on. They'll look to reverse that trend on second and goal. They'll try to run with Hunt. And he's in. Touchdown, Houston. Curry's gone with his second touchdown of the afternoon. And the Texans are in for six. So he's had a nose for the end zone here. Ooh, you 
is not a good play call. We'll see. Now a play fake here on first down. This is caught. It's Cooks. Yes. And he'll be taken down, but not before they work it across midfield. 28 yards the gain there on the catch and run. So from Charger territory now. Here's a first and 10 at the 47. They'll go option to the short side. And he's going to be met at about the 43. Give him three on the keeper there, and it is second down. Anytime you decide to use your quarterback as a runner, most of the time when you design a play, you're expected to break a little bit bigger than this one because when you run him on short gains, your risk-reward and him taking hits, I'm not sure that's the payoff they were looking for. And past the 35, he'll be dropped a yard or two shy of the 30. Second catch for him today, and it'll wind up a first down. Partner, I like that they're staying aggressive on offense because, to me, this drive is what is known as a put-away drive. You score here, that might put this one to bed. I like the fact that they're playing with confidence and not playing with fear. And he's got this down almost to the 20 before Team he's dropped. Let's 11 go. yards here, just like last play. Yeah. Well, that's a carry they have to be satisfied with. And throughout this game, they've been satisfied with what he's given them. Whenever they've needed a big run, this is our fifth first year. down, he's the guy they've turned to. And it doesn't matter what the defense thinks. They might, they've got the confidence to keep handing it to him and keep picking up good yardage. If nothing else, they've already taken a couple minutes off the clock here already as they come up second down. They'll give to Hunt here on the option. Able to fight for about four yards there in the 13. That call makes sense because they've been throwing it well on this drive. And once again, they show passing formation, showing the shotgun. Then they ran out of it. That's a nice play by them defensively, though, to hold it to a short game. Now, this is a big third down, and you'd have to think we'd see a timeout right away if they can't stop them here. Oh, I like Back to throw. Matthews. Open man there is Collins complete. So fresh out of the two-minute warning, and here's another timeout taken with 1.55 remaining. I'm trying to run in. A good chance now to put this game on ice. I'm really trying this to is run first in. and goal. They'll try to oh. run in, go an option right. Now the Chargers will use the second of their timeouts. That will really leave them with just one remaining in this fourth quarter of play. Got to figure the rush is going to be fierce again as they come up second and 13. Here's Hunt. Now the defense will burn their third and final timeout as they'll head to the sideline and talk over what to do next. A lot of tired bodies on that field, but this is a big play, third and goal. They'll run again with Hun. And he'll take this one in for the Texans touchdown. Kareem Hunt, his third touchdown of the game, number nine on the season. And the Texans are closing in on a third straight win as they widen the gap further here in the fourth quarter. Thank you. Is it okay if I break one of our rules? I know I'm great. Thank you. Josh is the best QB in the world. Thank you. Down to a knee, here yeah, is the Texans look to let the clock roll. Down to a knee, here is the Texans look to let the clock roll. So time to start going in the other direction as they come up now third and long. Bro, this game's weird. This is weird, right? Let's left do this. Oh, I didn't do my thing. Oh, that's how you go. Interesting. Oh, I had to hack it. So he'll take a knee here to wrap this one up. He's going to want to keep that game ball. He was sensational. So Houston going to come away here with the victory. When you look back over the score sheet, interesting. A very clean game, no turnovers by either side. An absolute rarity when we watch games Same now percent. because defenses have put such an emphasis on taking the ball away. Okay.
thank you for watching make sure you like comment and subscribe and get ready for the next episode we are gonna up the difficulty because i think this is too easy but we'll see and peace